Getting kills. That shellbot is getting our beacon. Our built-in weapon seems rampage! Holy man! Oh, we got this guy. We got him. We got him. Boom! Kill! We got him. Okay, let's try to get this beacon. Believe it or not, we are bringing the Alkin back to life. We have a Mark III Alkin. We're just putting on the cool noble skin. This is one of the original dragon robots in the game. You guys actually highly requested this. We have four light weapon slots, only one passive module slot. Our durability is pretty low. In our ability, Dragon Strike, we pretty much can fly in the air for a limited amount of time. And we have a built-in Scourge weapon. No resistance. So unlike the Ao Guang, we do not have a resistance when we're flying i have no idea how this is going to perform but we're going to try it out you guys requested it we're trying it in champion league we also have our skyros our cryptic fenrir our sonic scorpion our capri and our Miramits if we need it let's go to war here like i said i don't know how this is going to perform but you guys asked for it let's get our boosters going and let's do some beacon rush all right here we go beacon rush time let's go okay we have landed here on nighttime shenzhen and right off the bat here, we're dropping the uh, Aokin. So we do have our Armadillo Drone. So 227,000 HP. Not a ton of HP. And that's with all of the upgrades. See, that is an issue. So when we fly, we don't actually have any extra resistance like you do with the Aogua. It's still the same robot. Okay, here we go. We just have that red lightning strike. That's our... That's our ability, pretty much. It's flying and using that red lightning strike. Oh, that guy is just hiding there, I guess. Okay. Okay. Man, I don't know what players are thinking when they see us. Like, I bet a lot of players don't even know what this robot is. This came out so long ago with the dragon robots, but nobody ever really used the Alkin. Hold on. This guy's dropping. There we go. All right. Oh, that's a harpy. We're shredding him. We are shredding him almost. Oh, we got him. We got him. We got him. Come on. Come on. Kill. We just killed a harpy with her Alkin. Nice. And remember, these are also the Eldritch Cremola. So that's why they look a bit different. They look a bit cooler. They're kind of built for the Eldritch Kepri, but I'll still take it. Our health is down to 184. Is this guy AFK? That guy might be AFK. Let's see. Oh, no. He baited us. It's a hell burner. Retreat. Retreat. Code Red, he baited us big time. Holy man. Was he just sitting there for like two minutes doing nothing? Come on, we almost got him. He's lagging, he's lagging. Yes, double kill. He fully baited us. He was sitting there, then we moved close, and then he tried to attack us, but it backfired, and we smoked him. All right, we actually have two kills right now. That's why our armadillo drone is actually up to two, uh, two stacks, I guess you call it. Okay, we're shooting a little bit. We're shooting, we're shooting. Man, this is kind of dangerous. We are in center right now. Come on, can we get this? Can we get this? Boom, triple kill. We are up to a triple kill. I didn't even think we were going to be able to get a triple kill, but here we are. We are dominating. Not quite dominating, but we're still, we're still getting kills. That shellbot is getting our beacon. Our built-in weapon seems rampage. Holy man, our built-in weapon seems so flimsy. It seems like it's not doing a whole lot. I don't even know how much damage it really does. Okay, we're gonna back up here, we're backing up. Yeah, so I didn't put the nuke amplifier on here just because I figured we wouldn't survive that long to really stack up the damage on the nuke amp. But now we got a rampage. But still, I think the anti-control, if you only have one module slot, I think the anti-control or the last stand is a better option than a new camp. Um, hold on here. This Oroshi is coming. Oh, he grabbed our beacon. That's not good. That is not good. I think we would be absolutely screwed if we didn't have a bit rangier weapons like these. These guys are in our home. We're getting four capped too. Yikes. Okay, we're getting four capped and that is not too great. Um... Uh, Okay, a bit of shredding there. Armadillo is up to four. So that's four times 15. Uh, what is that? 60 defense points. Highlander there. Oh, we're smoking him. We're shredding. We're shredding that Highlander guy. That's a siren. Boom! Kill! 
Man, we've smoked a Kepri, a Siren, a Harpy, a Shellbot. Uh-oh, this might be the end, though. Oh, double kill! Another kill on a Mender! Bro, we're tearing it up. Uh-oh, that's this kid. I jinxed it. I jinxed it! Smoky pancake waffle sandwich. Why do we have no beacons? Okay, I'm gonna go back to my home beacon. It seems like we have no beacons right now. We have like half a beacon. Oh, we're caught in the, in the open. Okay, okay, we died, but man, that was actually a really good kill streak for an Owkin. A freaking Owkin? One passive module slot and four light weapons? Like that robot, I, I, you don't ever see in Champion League. Nobody ever runs that. Okay, let's try to get some beacons here quick. Um, oh, that is an Arthur. Oh, that is an Arthur. Okay, see, this is the special ability of this Skyros. We can push robots off beacons. This Arthur is like 10 times bigger than us. And I'm pushing him off there. We capped the beacon. See how stupid that is? We literally pushed that Arthur off the beacon and capped it. Let's drop our Muramits quick. Um, okay, Muramits right off the bat. Okay, let's try to smoke him here. There we go. Now he's just realizing what we are. And we are cooking him up. Boom! Titan Slayer. He didn't stand a chance. We dropped in the Muramits just in time. What is that a Nightingale? Really? You're going to try to take me out with that? All right, man. All right, bro. All right, bro. Oh, we have our quantum sensor. That's why we can still shoot him. Jeez, what a reverse. Now we're getting a four cap. We were getting four cap. Now the enemy team's getting four capped. Are they down two players already? That would be pretty... I guess we're still we're six minutes into the game. Double kill. Okay, I'm just waiting for this guy. EMP him. Boom. Can't use his defense. And we are dominating the skies in this game. The Aokin and the Muramits. I think they're mecking. They might be mecking out here. We are mecking them out. Hot sauce. Pickled eggs. Pickled eggs are gross. Uh, come on. Nope, we didn't get that kill either. This is definitely, in my opinion, still the best Titan build in the game. There's still no real counters to this Miramets build. Okay, let's just drop in our Fenrir, but their beacon bar is pretty much gone. All right, there we go. Boom, we got the win. We got a Rampage plus two more kills with the Aokin. The freaking Aokin. I did not expect that. Let's see what our damage was. 3.93 beacons. Not too bad. Second on our team. I'll take it. Let's go game two. Let's see what we can do again with the Aokin build in Champion League. Here we go. Let's do it. All right, carrier map. We're going to go same formula. It worked well the first game. Let's see if it works now. Um, Armadillo drone on our Aokin. Let's drop it in. All right, we're running. We're running. We're running. It's almost like the uh, the Eldritch Cremola don't really match the look of the Aokin, but whatever, man. I always thought it was weird when they released all three dragon robots. And really, only the Ao Jun was ever a Champion League robot. The Ao Kin and the Ao Guang were never good enough from the start. And they were never really buffed either. So, I always thought, was, I always thought it was kind of weird that they felt the need to release all three. And they all have pretty similar abilities in strength. But, for some reason, I don't know. Okay, we're gonna load up here. Yeah, he didn't get that kill. Darn it. There's a fight over center beacon right now. It looks like we're losing. So we got one guy in there. And I can't really charge in there, man. I'm not really a tank robot. I'm more of a flying pigeon than a dragon. This is the flying seagull of death. They should rename the Aoki into that. The flying seagull. And then its ability is seagull crap. We're, we unload on the cars. All right, here we go. Boom, kill. There we go. That was an Oroshi. We got that Oroshi. See, this might be the strength of where a nuke amp would be really good. If we're sitting back and we're shooting at enemies, then it's kind of building up our damage. Man, they're pushing our beacon. They are pushing this beacon. Fast. Uh-oh. Okay, let's use our north light. They're coming in hot. They've capped that beacon. Double kill, but that's not good. They have capped our beacon. 
This is Code Red Ice Cream Oreo Sandwich Alert. Whoa, what a coincidence. That is an Al Guang. You can't even get through a North Light. You do not see that very often in Champion League. That is an Al Guang. I'm going to assume that player doesn't know what he's doing because he's running... He's running different weapons on his Al Guang and triple kill. I don't think that was that was on purpose. So I think he was just clued out and he doesn't know what league he is in. Bro, we need beacons right now. They're pushing now our home beacon. We're shredding this guy up though. We're shredding him up. Oh, we're going down. Okay, I'm gonna hit my north light. That is an Ao Jun. Man, we're facing a lot of dragon robots here. We are facing a lot of dragon robots. That was that Ao, the Ao Guang we took out, then the Ao Ming. Not the Ao Ming, the Ao Jun. So many Ao robots. Mix them up. I pretty much mixed up all the dragon robots until a year ago. Just the names, I would always forget. I hate when Pixonic makes very similar named robots. Oh, we got this guy. We got him, we got him. Boom, kill. We got him. Okay, let's try to get this beacon. Our beacon bar is getting demolished. Demolished. Okay. I'm surprised we're still alive, even. We haven't really, we haven't been like camping either. Oh, that is a Capri. This Capri is gonna tear us up, though. Okay, we gotta retreat a bit. Let's go to center beacon. The beacons are changing, but we're still down big on the beacon bar. Okay, my teammate is getting the beacon, and we capped it too. Okay, boom. We have the center beacon. But we need it. We need three or four beacons right now. Oh, this is a mender. This is a mender. Double kill. Yes. Yes. I wonder if it's really the Cremola that are carrying us right now. Unless the Alkin. Whoa. Bro, we are off the map right now. We're getting boosted. Ah! No. That was risky. I was flying away from those Minoses off the ship, but then we couldn't make it back. Oh man, our beacon bar is getting crushed. I don't know if I can do anything at this point. We have half a beacon and the, this isn't going to work. Alright, well, let's take this time. Uh, I'll remind you guys to join the Gargantua giveaway that's going on right now, so make sure to join that. That second game was a little bit disappointing, but we still got some Alkin kills. So there it is. I tried it. Those are probably the best weapons to try on the Alkin. 1.5 in a short game. Not too bad. They had a duo pair on the other side. But man, there is the Alkin. Intellect type piece. SpaghettiO chickens. I tried, guys. I tried.